What is the best settings for MACD indicator? You know that. We didn't, so we created tests. Hello, this is Igor from Ethics Igor YouTube channel, and right now on this chart, you can see the MACD indicator. Uh, this MACD indicator has two lines, and uh, standard MACD doesn't have two lines. So, if you want to have the MACD with two lines, please just go below this video you have download link you can free download the macd for two with the two lines and use that in your trading now let me start to talk about this major topic so this is the macd this is the one of the most used oscillators uh together with relative strength index and uh people wanted very often to change the settings and to improve trading and we wanted to see are there any 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 logic there to do that so we will share our our opinion the first thing you know if you you could go to the settings you have the parameters that you can add for your MACD indicator you can add fast EMA slow AMA MACD SMA so just to see what that means fast AMA it means fast line this is the 12 periods exponential weighted average then we have a slow line or the 26 periods EMA and we have a signal line of the 9 periods EMA so what we did we created the rules we created several combinations and created buy and sell rules on the 13 minute chart of course later we repeat this process for uh, 15 minutes and for a war one hour chart just to little bit um make some research for intraday trading and macd settings so our rules are very simple buy if you see bullish macd cross or zero line cross and the price touch a significant level and the price is in bullish channel stop loss is in the last important level swing target at the next level so we created the same cell just uh, just uh, opposite um trade sell if you see the bearish magni cross or zero line cross and the price touch an important level and the price is in the bearish channel stop loss is the last important level swing and target is the next level so uh how we did it what's important levels for us for us important levels are previous low and highs that we can see on the chart we did that automatically using our simple algorithm you can use any kind of algorithm because in there's algorithms in training view you have algorithms in MACD you can use anything and we tried we tried to to create um, target to be usually one-to-one -one and to use the next level like I said one-to-one -one stop loss stop loss entry position and entry position target so this is the very very simple simple expert advisor nothing special if you test this expert advisor you will you will have a losing trades but it's a normal thing whatever strategy that you try it will usually be uh, the losing trades but what we did we removed any kind of commissions any kind of spreads and of course after we test these strategies we had a we had a positive positive balance uh, of course in the real trading we will have a negative balance on the end because because of losing trades and because of all these spreads and commissions as you know just to repeat you know then but just just to tell one thing if you for example use test tr strategies in expert advisor or in trading view or su such a thing and you see for example that you have a uh, positive positive balance and profitable balance after testing usually you will have because uh, there's no spread commission real trading and etc etc uh, for example you have a uh, 7,000 trades and you created uh, uh, 2,000 pips excellent thing but in reality you have a uh, 7,000 trades it's a uh, more than 7,000 pips of loss for every single trade and when you do as a real trading on the end if they have a negative balance but let me not, not i don't want to talk a lot of about strategies and testing the strategies i just want to tell you this was a very simple expert advisor so you we use magd we use a lower swing for stop loss and we try to use one-to-one 
one-to-one um, -one, um, ratio for trading and this is the this is the whole story now let me see for 30 minutes what were the results you can see very similar results but the best results are for 12 26 and 9 of course we created various combinations using the uh, 12 24 6 for fast mi then for slow mi we use 26 52 34 13 for macd sma we use 9 5 18 so before this we interview traders which kind of uh, different settings they use and we created we created some nine combinations that we tested in our in our case study and what are conclusions i don't want to talk a lot about this i just want conclusions the best magni settings for 15 minute chart are parameters 24 52 and 18. however these settings in only a few percent better in our case study than the default settings 12 26 9. this is normal why because if you increase little bit of periods your system will be more stable because then you like you trade in a bigger time frame you have a less trades you have a less trade because of this and because of that your your profit will be bigger and because of that this these settings was uh, clearly the same as default settings the same story is for 30 minute charts we saw the table a little bit before and you can see that the default settings are 12 26 and 9 and there's no such a big big statistical evidence that other strategies are much much um uh, better than than standard standard settings and for one hour chart we have similar results as a, as a as a 15 minute charts that's a normal thing as i said uh if you increase a little bit periods you will have less trades because you it's a wider it's a wider wider um wider time period and because of less of trades your balance on the end of the testing will be a little bit better and that little bit better as is something that we watch so what is the major major conclusion here the best settings for macd as uh, just okay you will you cannot increase significantly uh, your trading if you change period however if you trade one minute two minutes 15 minutes five minutes very 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 lower time frames in that case if you increase periods it will be better because you have a less number of trades and because of less number of trades your profitability will be better so i hope that you like this case study i wish you great day and bye bye